Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Pathetic CNN uses Barbara Bush's passing to launch disgusting attack. Americans are mourning the loss of former First Lady Barbara Bush. While most news outlets celebrated the woman, CNN used the opportunity to do something disgusting. It is sickening viewers. Yesterday, former First Lady Barbara Bush, who is the wife of former President George H. W. Bush, passed away at the age of 92. People across the country expressed their condolences to the Bush family at the death of their matriarch. Many took the opportunity to celebrate the character and accomplishments of the woman, who was universally recognized for her strength, dignity, and hard work. You won't have to look long online to find tributes to Mrs. Bush. Many people remarked on her work to spread literacy across the country. Some estimate her efforts helped millions of people to learn to read. Former President George W. Bush, the son of Barbara Bush, was recently interviewed alongside his wife. They spoke fondly of her, remembering the incredible impact she had on the United States. But far be it for fake news CNN to let this opportunity pass by without embarrassing themselves. It seems like they cannot help but prove to the world how utterly corrupt, biased, and petty they are. As the world mourned the passing of a great woman, CNN hosts Anderson Cooper and Jeffrey Tubin used the moment to insult President Donald Trump. That's right, as people were saddened to hear of Mrs. Bush's passing, they mocked the sitting president and his family. What do you call that kind of behavior? Oh right, deplorable. While discussing Barbara Bush's legacy on Tuesday evening, CNN's Anderson Cooper and Jeffrey Tubin could not resist using the opportunity to slam President Donald Trump. After news broke of Barbara Bush's passing, Tubin rattled off the list of adjectives associated with the former first lady, public service oriented, the honesty, decency and asked, what about the contrast to our current president? Source, Breitbart. I mean this family, whatever else you think of the Bushes, were a family that was wall-to-wall -wall decent. Good to people. Considerate of others, Tubin said. And I'm sorry, I just keep thinking of Donald Trump in the White House who has none of the qualities that the Bushes have. It's just a sign of how different this country is now than it was not that many years ago. Wow, what kind of scumbags would use the death of a former first lady to push their hatred of the current president? We get it, CNN, you're a pile of biased garbage. You disgrace the very name of journalism with your tainted, tawdry news. But can't you at least hold your tongue for two seconds? Barbara Bush was a well-respected figure. Liberals and conservatives held her in high regard, not just for her work but for her personality and leadership qualities. Her death marks the end of a great generation of women, but all CNN can do is look for ways to bash President Trump. During the election, Barbara Bush expressed her dislike of Trump. That was her opinion and she had every right to speak her mind. Anderson Cooper, obviously, used that as an excuse to drag Bush and Trump's name through the mud. Barbara Bush was critical of Trump during the 2016 election cycle, saying she did not understand how women could vote for Trump. She also said that she was sick of him and didn't waste time thinking about Trump. Cooper said that Barbara Bush was so repelled by Donald Trump and added that Trump is antithetical to all of the values she grew up believing and lived her life by. Source, Breitbart. Really? Suddenly now the liberal news outlet is celebrating the virtues of a conservative woman? I guess they'll exploit anyone to attack President Trump. It's not worth even dignifying their sleazy attacks with rebuttals. We know of the decency of President Trump and his wife Melania. Time and again, they prove to be careful, respectful, and decent people. All of that is ignored by CNN, which distorts stories to slander our commander-in-chief. Stay classy, liberals. And to think, they wonder why so many Americans are ditching the Democratic Party. They have proven to be selfish, dishonest, hateful creatures. Even the passing of a great woman is an excuse to sling mud. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.